Acting President Yemi Oshimbaju has urged the West Africa sub-regional body ECOWAS to ensure no effort is spared in ensuring that strong, resilient health systems exist in its member countries. He gave this charge at the official opening ceremony of the 18th Ordinary Meeting of the ECOWAS Assembly of Health Ministers. Our correspondent, Maria Olashende, reports. The event is the 18th Ordinary Meeting of the ECOWAS Assembly of Health Ministers and it is declared open by Acting President Yemi Oshibajo. In his welcome remarks, Nigeria's Health Minister places emphasis on the need for West African countries to strengthen their health system to deliver high-impact interventions. He is also of the opinion that the West African region needs to unite to effectively control the sale of tobacco. But we require a concerted effort is tobacco control. We must not be deceived by the economic gains of producing and selling tobacco and its products. The adverse health consequences of smoking far outweigh the economic benefits. We need to unite within the region to effectively control sale of cigarettes to underage ban is used in public places and enforce implementation of appropriate sanctions in order to promote the health of our people. On a spot, Nigeria's acting president, Yemi Oshibajo, expresses concern at the recent outbreak of the Ebola virus disease in Democratic Republic of Congo and urges the West African sub-region to actively take steps to establish preventive mechanisms that would prevent its spread to the West Africa sub-region. He stated Nigeria's readiness to give the necessary support towards ensuring adequate takeoff of the Regional Center for Disease Control Prevention, RCDC. Access to healthcare and drugs also remain significant problems. And it seems to me that the West African Health Organization, through its strategic operations, must invest more effort towards the reduction of the burden of communicable diseases in the region such as malaria, tuberculosis, and HIV AIDS. Never again should West Africa be taken by surprise in such outbreaks as we experienced in 2014 during the Ebola virus outbreak with the colossal loss of lives and security threats to national survival. Nigeria is committed to giving the necessary support towards ensuring the adequate takeoff of the RCDC. The acting president also tasked the West African Health Organizations to put in place measures that would make public health emergency preparedness an achievable goal. Maria Olashendi, TVC News, Abuja.